Badu Jack rematch is something Marcus Brown would love. Marcus Brown shrugged off the first defeat of his career against Sean Pascal. Although he was disappointed in the overall outcome, the New York native wasn't tripping over the end result. With a nasty gash over his left eye, things between them ended, leading to Pascal picking up the win. But while it was easy to put that one behind him, his loss to Arthur Bederbiev was a wake-up call. On December 17, 2021, Brown did everything that he could to strip the Russian monster of his WBC and IBF world titles. After a strong three minutes in the opening frame, the now 32-year-old felt that things were on the verge of going wrong. Round after round, Brown fought list Brown fought tremendously, flicking out a tremendous jab while attempting to cover up against the ropes. As referee as the referee stepped in during the ninth round, Brown, as he um, soldered back to his locker room, knew that his time at 175 pounds had formally come to an end. Overall, Brown won't make any excuses while he accepts his defeat. He does believe that the weight played a bit of a role of his lackluster performance. So after taking nearly two years to build up his body and more muscular, Brown made his cruiserweight debut. It was an easy night at the it was an easy night in the office as Adrian Taylor was roughly dominated over and over for the remainder of the 10 rounds. Now having tested the waters a bit, Brown is hoping to face much stiffer competition in terms of who he wants next. He recently revealed that anyone who's holding a belt can get it. Any of the champions, to be honest, said Brown to BoxingScene.com during a recent interview. Although he doesn't have any particular targets on his hit list, Brown wouldn't mind facing a familiar name in his new weight class. In early 2019, Brown fought in one of the bloodiest fights in recent memory against Badu Jack. Game plans were thrown out the window and both men left it all in the ring. Despite hitting the deck in the fifth round, Brown somewhat cruised to a unanimous decision victory. Jack, since then, has made the cruiserweight division his home, winning the WBC title against Makabu Longa. With neither man having an immediate dance partner, if Jack is in the mood for some get back, Brown would welcome a sequel. If Badu Jack wants to do it again, I would love to do it again at Cruiserweight. End quote. Let me know in the comment section what y'all think about Badu Jack. Remax is on the mind of uh, Marcus Brown. He's trying to get that belt. Let me know in the comment section what y'all thoughts on about that. Have a good one.